Hey guys, welcome back to my kitchen. So I made these cookies the other day and they were so good that I had to make them again to show you guys. The rum and raisin oatmeal cookies. Check the description box below for the full ingredients list. And remember, if you like the recipe, please like the video and consider subscribing. It really helps out the channel. Let's get started. First, I'm going to take half a cup of raisins and to that I'll add three tablespoons of dark rum. I'm going to set this mixture to the side while I prepare the other ingredients. Now in a food processor or blender, add one and a half cups of oats and pulse it a few times until the oats are finely chopped. Then pour the oats out into a small mixing bowl. Now into the mixing bowl I'll add another half cup of oats, one cup of flour, and one teaspoon of baking soda. I'm going to combine the dry ingredients mixture and then I'll set it to the side. Now in another large mixing bowl add one cup of cubed butter. It should be just a few degrees below room temperature. Next add half a cup of white sugar, one cup of brown sugar, and half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Now with a mixer on high speed, I'm going to cream the butter and sugar for about two to three minutes. Creaming the butter and sugar incorporates air into the mixture. This results in a cookie with a lighter texture that will not fall flat and spread out in the oven. Next I'm going to be adding two eggs. It's easiest to beat the eggs in one at a time. Continue to beat the mixture for another minute or so until it's light and fluffy. Next I'm going to add the raisins and rum mixture and I'll mix that until it's fully combined. Now I'm going to add half a teaspoon of ground cinnamon and half of the dry ingredients mixture. Stir in the dry ingredients mixture until it's almost fully combined and then add the second half of the dry ingredients and continue to mix. When the mixture is fully combined, grab a baking sheet lined with parchment paper and make golf ball sized balls about three to four centimeters apart. This recipe makes 24 cookies. Place the cookies in a preheated oven at 350 degrees for about 12 minutes until they're golden around the edges. When the cookies are done, remove them from the oven and place them onto a wire rack to cool for a few minutes. When the cookies have cooled enough that they can be lifted from the pan, transfer them directly onto the wire rack to finish cooling. Make sure not to cool your cookies completely on the baking sheet because the steam will cause them to go soft on the bottom and stick to the pan. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like and consider subscribing if you want to see more recipes. Let me know in the comments below if you tried the recipe or if you have any requests for future videos. Till next time, take care and good luck cooking.